Hey guys, what's up? What you see behind me is the disaster area that is my house. I've been working on it pretty much non-stop since I got home from BPM. Even before I left for BPM, I was working on it. Front's almost done. Now I'm working on the rear. Got a new balcony up here. I'm siding. And there's a lot of repairs to be done as I'm going. So we're going to gig tonight. I just want to give you an explanation as to why you haven't seen anything from me. But, you know, stay tuned. We're going to get some videos up real soon. As soon as I get this sided and painted, it's back to videos. So here's the gig log. Yeah, so the house has been all consuming, literally sun up to sundown every day since BPM, and even before that. So I'll have more on that later. I'll show you the finished project. I, I just don't want to show you bits and pieces. It's getting depressing. I'll show you too when it's done. Anyway, gig log tonight, wedding reception. Pretty nice people. This guy's impressed with the fact that I have an RCF rig. Very few clients asked me about my gear. This guy did. And as soon as I said RCF, uh, he, he was very happy. So that eh, should be a good gig. Check it out. And a little quick fuel before we set up. I'm about eh, 40 minutes early for setup. So here we are up on a stage tonight. You recognize this setup. The RCF, no stuff. Some mega bars in the back lighting up that backdrop. The DJ skirt stuff on the table. Scrim Kings on the tripod. Jellyfish under the speakers. This some floor washes behind. King. And way down here, Black Sea and Royale on the floor. Alright, everybody's getting a bite to eat, including myself. A little chicken and beef stroganoff with a roll. Warming up my butter, it was frozen. Warming it up in my stroganoff gravy. Should be a good party though. We did a grand entrance. These people are a lot of fun. Everybody's really nice. Looking forward to tonight. Should be a good time. There you have it. it. Wasn't a bad party. It didn't take off like I thought it would. I had real high hopes for this one. The older people were glued to that Badger game, and then when it was over, they kind of trickled out, and I was essentially playing for a lot of kids. I would say 15, 16 year old girls, and they had fun. 
couple things I'll vlog about here at the end of the night. One is kind of irrelevant to the gig itself, but I did play We Know Speak Americano by request. Someone asked for it. First time anyone's asked for that uh, here in the States. Of course, I was just in the UK, heard a lot. I know it's been huge over there. And the one person who asked for it danced to it. No one else knew it. I thought maybe Kiss FM had authenticated it by actually playing it, which it seems like is kind of what it takes for songs to take off here for Kiss to play them. Shows you what powerful media that really is. Radio for that age group, I guess. Teenagers. And even people in their 20s, I suppose. But now Kiss has not authenticated it yet. But it will. It will. Don't know why I wanted to vlog about that, but I thought I would. The other thing I wanted to mention real quick, uh, kind of got me thinking about this gig. I showed some crowd shots that were good, and I showed some crowd shots that weren't so good, I mean, as far as packed dance floors, but what I showed you was the reality of the gig. Now, sometimes customers from the agency, I guess, who are looking at me will find me somehow. I think that my agents give them my YouTube channel kind of blindly and they just find videos and they'll see maybe a gig like this where it wasn't like the biggest party ever and they'll say wow you know he shot a gig and there was half empty dance floor and I don't want that DJ but you know what the half empty dance floor sometimes happens to us this is real and it's for you it's not for clients but it kind of got me thinking wow you know maybe people want you to just bullshit them when you're marketing to them when you're trying to sell to them but, I mean, why would people want that? Why wouldn't people want to see how it really is sometimes? I mean, I got gig logs where the floor's packed all night. I got gig logs where they're not. Again, that's reality. That's what I'm thinking. And I think the clients that I have uh, appreciate that. <laughs> Having said that, there aren't a lot of videos up for my clients on my channel. Most, uh, most of them are for you, the DJs, and people interested in this kind of stuff. So maybe I'll make a point to get some like videos specifically for clients soon. Got any ideas on what those videos should contain? Let me know. That's it. I gotta work on the house tomorrow, so I gotta get home and get to bed. Thanks a lot. Practice and enjoy.